What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Randy here, RTSMobile.com, bringing you a quick New Year, uh, New Year's video, first video of 2020. Let's come into the new year with a bang. We're gonna jump right over to uh, meet Joe the Crow with Mand. Uh, he is considering doing a little attacky, attacky on on my castle. Um, let's see here. He's got 135 million power to my 52 million power. He has keep level 26, I am keep level 22. So this is probably gonna hurt a little bit. So let's get ready to uh, to take the pew. And actually let's get my, whoops, up. oh no. Let's get this, swap out my warlord. Get my other warlord in here. Don't hit me yet, Joe, don't hit me yet, baby. Coming in hot, bloodthirst coming in hot. Set as defender, there we go. Set my bloodthirster as my defender. Significantly boost my melee uh, damage. Should be good. Up oh, there's Joe. He hit me with the old scout. There it is. Coming in hot. Coming in hot, Joe. He scouted me. He did it. Let's see what we got. Let's see what happens. Let's see if the attack comes. I know he's kind of chewing on it. He's like, let's. Let's do it, or what are we gonna do, Joe? I'm excited. This is New Year's. Joe the Crow is uh, is definitely a B M F. That is a bad, um, aching mother fisher. If you like fishing and aches, um, I think he's typically. We'll just jump over to his troops killed. I think he's rank one on the troops killed for this server by a huge margin. Joe the Crow, 60 million troops killed so he is uh, he definitely uh, definitely kills a lot of people up oh, there's the attack there it is get excited here we go oh, it's coming in it's gonna hurt so good oh no oh my gosh so, oh here comes 500,000 losses here we go here we go oh, let's see how it looks how do we do oh. Uh, I can only grunt so many times before it... Come on, I'm, we're waiting for the attack to hit. Waiting for the attack to hit. It should be coming soon. It's calking. The game... We broke the game. Oh, there it is! Oh my god, 20 million health! That's it! That was the one hit. That was my one hit. Okay. Alright. Oh. Ow. Ah. Alright, Joe. You won, dude. I'm gonna leave. I'm leaving. That was a nice hit. Let's get a random TP out of here. Ugh. Oh. 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 Uh. Murata? Where is that? Oh, somebody else from me and tried to hit me at the same time. Joe, why your boy tried to hit me too? Okay, well, that was a good hit. Let's go see how we did. It doesn't look good because my champion, he's got my champion in there. He's got my champion. Um, put that bubble on there. Let's just put on one of those. Let's see how it went. Could have went well, right? Could have went nice. Could have been a good, could have been a good hit. That was a good hit by Joe. He definitely did some work to me. He definitely did some work there. Uh, I would say that's a that's a pretty dominating attack by Joe. That was a good job he did. Uh, as you can see, Chaos Chosen are pretty god mode. Um, pretty god mode right there. Joe, nice attack, my man. Good video, baby. Let's dissect that report now to have my bubble up. Okay, so he sent Chaos Chosen, which are the strongest units in the game for damage until tier 5. Um, they do massive DPS, so he attacked me with a march full of them. He did a good job. Um, as you can see, I have a lot of wounded troops here. A lot of 
dead and wounded troops, uh, quite a few of those. And then also, looks like most of my tier 4 lived, which is good. But everything else definitely died. Everything else definitely died. So when the Chaos Chosen attacks a tier 3 unit, his 1200 damage turns into... Let's get my calculator. There's baby. Get the calculator out. 1200 times 1.75. His damage goes to 2100 base damage when attacking tier 3 troops, which make the Chaos Chosen um, the strongest troop in the game for attacking a lower tier. A, and also one of the strongest of troops in the game overall, regardless. Just that high damage value with the 75% multiplier on it definitely uh, definitely does some work. Um, I was recording. I'll post in a minute. Boom, baby! <laughs> For the tube, man. For the tube. For the tube, baby. For the tube. <laughs> uh. Alright, okay, let's look at the healing bill. It's a good thing I stockpile tons of resources because this is going to be a costly one, I can tell. Let's see. Oh, that's, that's actually way better than I thought. Yeah, Lucifer is going to love to see that. Uh, okay, so it's definitely going to set me back about three days or so of gathering, or probably, probably closer to four days of gathering. But it was a good hit. Um, 23 days of healing is definitely a lot of healing time. So we'll be breaking this up into like one day heals or maybe 12 hour healing sessions. That way I get my alliance assists in. Um, so let's do the first, uh, let's just undo that and we'll go ahead and get my get my tier 4 trained up. And then we'll get my cornies trained up. Let's just get this, oh that right there is already, that right there is already a day. So we'll just start with healing them first. Boom baby, okay. Healing them first. Um, Hit the assist, there we go, and we're just gonna heal it in little blocks. Uh, okay. And I love you guys long time. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and upload this video, but thanks for watching again, that was a great hit by Joe. Uh, we've got uh, a couple hundred million resources and a healing bill, plus uh, you know three, three and a half weeks worth of healing time. They'll get cut down by Alliance Assist, but we're still talking like a good week and a half of heals. Uh, that is tier four. First tier three. Happy New Year, everybody. Coming into it with a bang, baby. Mad respect to Joe, and uh, we'll catch you guys in a little bit. Randy out. Peace.